Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the September 19th, 2019 meeting of the Sacramento Area Flood Control Agency. Madam Clerk, will you please call roll and establish a quorum? Thank you. Matt Conant? Here. Nick Avdis? Tom Barandis? Here. Rachel Lynn Vanderwerf? Here. Cyril Shaw, Angelique Ashby, Jeff Harris. Present. Rick Jennings, Sue Frost, Don Natoli, Susan Peters, Patrick Kennedy, Lisa Nava. Here. We do have a quorum. Very good. Mr. Brandis, will you lead us in the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And the announcements, please. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This meeting of SAFCA is being broadcast live and will be cablecast without interruption on Metro Cable 14 and will be re-aired on Saturday, September 21st at 2 p.m. and Sunday, September 22nd at 9 a.m. This meeting is also webcast at www.sacmetrocable.tv and streaming video of the board meeting is available on SAFCA's website within 48 hours after the meeting. Members of the audience wishing to address the board should fill out a speaker form. They're located here on the lectern and bring it up to me. When addressing the board, please identify yourself for the record and please limit your comments to three minutes. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Lindsay. Uh, uh, Peter, you have a comment? Yeah, there we go. Uh, it looks like you have new software on your screens here, which we, we is do. pretty cool. So this is my first time here and mine won't uh, bring up the pic, the the picture. It just says Seth. So I'm, am I hitting a? Okay, hitting so here um, and then I'm hitting here. So here's oh, the broadcast, broadcast feed. feed. Yeah, that's what. Uh, yeah, and then if there's anything that goes up behind us, hit projector okay. feed. Okay, great. And then request a speed. That I that, those I could figure out. It okay. was just getting the broadcast feed. Very fancy. Yeah, we've we've entered a new era, Director Peters. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and it's it's taking a couple of months to work out the quirks, but it uh, seems to be a good system. So, for the record, Director Shaw has joined us, and Madam Clerk, can we have the first item? Oh no, I'm sorry. Public comments not on the agenda. We have no speaker slips. I I do not have any. Anybody in the audience wish to speak not on the agenda? Seeing none, we'll move to the first item. Our first items are consent matters, and items one through five are in order. Any comments or questions from directors? Seeing none. I have a motion from Director Shaw, second from Director Conant on consent. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Consent carries. Separate matters, item six, resolution number 2019-119, authorizing the executive director to award contract number 4454, the Dry Fence Creek Rehabilitation and Replacement Project, phase two, Sacramento County, California, to the lowest responsive and responsible bidder, and authorizing the executive director to execute the contract. Welcome, Ms. Sorgan. Thank you. Uh, Chair Harris, members of the board, Casey Sorgan, Senior Natural Resource Specialist. The item before you concerns the Lower Dry Creek Fence Rehabilitation and Replacement Project, which is located in the Rio Linda area of Sacramento, just south of Elkhorn Boulevard, and encompasses about 750 acres. This project will repair and replace about 16,000 linear feet of cattle fence and supports land management activities across lands and easements that SAFCA holds within the floodplain. Uh, this work will allow SAFCA to maintain floodplain capacity, reduce wildfire risk, reduce unauthorized access, and lower maintenance costs uh, by allowing grazing across these properties. The engineer's opinion on probable construction cost was estimated at $400,000 to $500,000. Three bids were received and opened on August 29th. 
the low bid in the amount of $447,977 was submitted by GW Demolition. The second low bid was in the amount of $598,000. We did receive a bid protest from the second lowest bidder. Upon review, legal counsel determined that the um, that there was no merit to the bid protest. Uh, therefore, staff recommends that the board adopt resolution number 2019-119, which will approve the changes to the contract documents that were made during the bid period, reject the bid protest, find that the bid submitted by GW Demolition is responsive, award contract number 4454 to the lowest responsive and responsible bidder, GW Demolition, and authorize the executive de director or his designee, designee to execute contract with GW Demolition in the amount of $447,977. Thank you. Thank you very much. Do we have any questions, comments from directors? Anybody from the audience? Care to address this item? I'll entertain a motion. Move to approve the first line of action. Moved by Conant. Second. Second by Brandis. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstention? Number six carries. Item number seven, resolution number 2019-120, authorizing the executive director to award contract number 4471, the North Area Levy Improvement Project 2019, City of Sacramento, Sacramento County, California, to the lowest responsive and responsible bidder and authorizing the executive director to execute the contract. Good afternoon, Pete Gelfi, Director of Engineering. This is uh, part of our cleanup activities and strengthening the levees in the north area. This work is mainly tied to um, RK Creek. There are two main elements. One was we, during the construction last year, we encountered a, a culvert that we didn't know was there, and now we need to install a positive closure device on it. The other main element of this contract is there's a 30-inch water line running across RK Creek, and we need to put two closure valves on either side of the levee system as a way if there's a problem with the pipe through the levee that we can turn off the valves and, and not damage the levee any more than, than what's going on there. Um, one thing is we only got one bidder on this work. Um, their bid was for about $950,000. Our engineer's estimate was for about $625,000, which is a pretty significant delta. Um, we investigated why others did not bid on the job. They weren't interested. There was risk working in the levee. Um, so we didn't feel as though there would be anything gained by trying to re-advertise this, this job and, and get additional bids. So we are recommending that we award this contract to this bidder um, and seek the board's approval to do so. Thank you, Pete. Um, comments, questions? Again, I'll take an, a motion. So moved. Moved by Abtis, second by Conant. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Motion carries. Item number eight, resolutions authorizing the executive director to enter into consulting services contracts with SOMAS, REY Engineers, Inc., Keldson, Sinoc, and Nudoc, Inc., and MHM, Inc., for land surveying and mapping services on an as-needed basis to support execution of SAFGAS programs and projects. And Mr. Tibbetts, before you get started, I'd like the board uh, just to call you out in public for receiving an award, the, the uh, William H. Hall Award for Flood Control from the American Society of Civil Engineers. Congratulations. Thank, thank you very much. I'm honored. And thank you, Chair Harris and members of the board. I'm, I'm here to talk about uh, surveying master service agreement contracts. So the, um, with all the projects going on, we, we have the American River Common Features Project, both the uh, 2016 project and the Natomas project. We have the Folsom Dam Rays project. We are su supporting the state of California on the Lower Elkhorn Basin Levee Setback Project. There are the SAFCA planning efforts to advance 500-year level of protection for the Sacramento metropolitan area, 
And then there are the levy modernization efforts happening throughout the Sacramento metropolitan area. The federal projects all require two things of us, of SAFCA. Um, first of all, we're supporting the Corps of Engineers on surveying efforts. Uh, with the supplemental appropriations, there's the um, Corps of Engineers has reached out to SAFCA many times already, and it's anticipated to continue in the future to support them on providing design level topography for their design efforts. And then additionally, the non-federal partners on federal projects are obligated to, to provide lands, easements, rights of way, and perform relocations. All of this effort requires a substantial surveying effort necessitating the need to award multiple contracts to support us on our surveying needs. Based on historic efforts on surveying and what's anticipated to be needed in the future, we're anticipating needing surveying support for control sur surveying and mapping, for right-of-way identification and definition, for boundary and right-of-way surveying and mapping, for topographic surveying and mapping, and for general project management support. SAFCA therefore went out for a request for qualifications for up to five surveying master service agreement contracts. Statement of qualifications were received from eight firms on August 23rd. And four of the firms best demonstrated being responsive and responsible bidders and demonstrated a knowledge of working on the flood control system. Staff therefore recommends that the board authorize the executive director to award four contracts, resolutions 121 through 124 to SOMAS, to REY Engineering, to KSN and to MHM for respective 1.5 million, 1.5 million, 750,000, and 500,000 to support sur SAFCA surveying needs in the upcoming three to five years. Any questions? Questions or comments from directors? Uh, I do have one. Um, can you tell us a little bit about SAFCA's experience with REY and um, KSN? Actually, to my knowledge, REY we, we've not worked with in the past. They have demonstrated a uh, strong ability for surveying. It, it's their uh, main focus uh, of, of their company, and they have demonstrated a, a knowledge of the work that type of work that we perform. They've acknowledged available staff and equipment to support our effort and are expected to perform our, our work adequately. KSN has performed some work for SAFCA and has done a very good job. So we, we have past experience with KSN. Okay, thank you very much. Any further comments or questions? Then I'll take a motion. Moved by Conant, second by uh, um, Frost, Director Frost. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Motion carries. Thank you very much, Dan, and congrats again. Uh, the rest, uh, directors, is received and file. It was the executive director's report Rick is out in um, Washington, D.C., talking about water issues, and I'm very happy to say, what did I say? He's in Memphis. Oh, he's Memphis. 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 Got it wrong. Um, well, anyway, he's doing good work for us, and he's, he's talking about the Yolo Bypass Cash Loop Partnership, a lot, of, a lot of things about the importance of the Yolo Bypass to our flood control projects. So, happily, he's out there deeply engaged doing work for us. Any other comments by directors? Then we stand adjourned. It's two minutes off. <laughs>